Chicago decision impacts more than 40,000 people here in Illinois. Chicago legal experts are gearing up to help dreamers and fight back. The Jam's Brandon Pope is live at the ICE headquarters in downtown with more. Good morning, Brandon. Hey, good morning, Felicia. President Donald Trump starting the countdown clock. As of today, Homeland Security will no longer be processing those DACA applications, and Chicagoans are making their voices loud and clear on this issue. Take a look at this video here. A massive protest taking place at Federal Plaza. Their message to the federal government, we are here to stay. Now, Illinois has the nation's fourth largest population of dreamers, and Christopher Elmore, he's one of the immigration lawyers gearing up for a fight on this issue. You. Christopher, thanks for joining us this morning. Oh, you're welcome. Happy to have you here. So first of all, if you could just uh, give us a sense, why the anger, why the fear, why the protest? Um, well, I think this is going to affect a lot of people, and a lot of people feel betrayed. A lot of these young adults came out of the shadows of their own free will to subject themselves to putting themselves on notice to the government for protection that they thought they were going to get, and now it feels like it's being taken away overnight. Now, President Donald Trump says he's going to give Congress six months to act on this. Many arguing this is just upholding the Constitution. Is it doing just that? I'm sorry, I didn't hear you with the button. Many, many arguing this is just upholding the Constitution. Is it doing just that? Um, I'm not sure I agree with that, and even the courts have split on that issue. Um, you kind of have to ask to wonder if it was really a constitutional issue, why is it going to last another six months? And for the dreamers out there, lots of fear out there, as we talked about earlier. What can they do and what can you do to help? So there are a lot of resources right now who are coming out to help the dreamers. Um, there's the American Immigration Lawyers Association, and then here locally, the Chicago Legal Responders Network are going to be setting up workshops to do um, free uh, sessions to give legal counsel and to help some of the people who are renewing. Um, just to let you know that those whose current DACA expires between September 5th and March 5th have until October 5th to get in a renewal right. application. Thanks a lot, Christopher. We'll be back with you next half hour. But right now we're at Ice HQ Live. We're going to toss it back to the studio.